Good morning everyone. I have here a given example in finding bitwise or an XOR. So these are the given examples that we're going to find bitwise or and an XOR. So or So in finding OR or in finding bitwise OR you just have to look at the pairs if it has a 1 in each pair then we're gonna put 1 but if it has two zeros then we also gonna put 1 so in this example we're just going to look if there is one in the each of pair then we're gonna simply put one then so this pair it has one this pair it has one this pair it has one and this pair it has one 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 so the bitwise or this have one and in finding the bitwise and we just have to simply multiply the given pairs and the result will be the result of bitwise and so we're gonna multiply this pair one times zero is equal to zero 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 that's it that's the bit, bitwise and and in finding the bitwise xor if we see the same number example is one and one and zero and zero that's the that's the same number of the given pair so we're gonna simply put zero so in this given bit string we don't see a pair of numbers like 1100 zero, zero. we don't see that in this given bit string so so the answer of this will be 1 because we don't see any pair of these given bit string so the answer of it one zero is one 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 so that's it that's the result of bitwise xor so in the give in the second given we just have to answer it so in bitwise or bitwise and bitwise x o r so in bitwise or we just simply look if there is one in each given pair of bit string so let's do it one one if we see one one in this given pair of bit string then we're gonna put one so one, 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 one. If we see both zeros in this given pair, then we're gonna simply put one, one, and one. And that's it. That's the result of bitwise O R. Then in bitwise and <coughs> we just simply multiply this pair of bit string then the result will be the result of bitwise and so 1 times 1 is equal to 1 1 times 0 is equal to 0 1 0 0 0 0 0 so this is the result of bitwise and and in the third is the bitwise xor so in bitwise 
XOR if we see both the same numbers in this pair given bit strings then we simply put 0 even if it is 1 and 1 so we simply put 0 in it so the answer of it is 1 and 1 is equal to 0 and 1 and 0 is equal to 1 then 1 1 is equal to 0 then 1 is 0 is equal to 1 1 0 1 0 and that's it that's the bitwise XOR thank you